School resource officers in Bartlesville and Dewey will be better prepared to protect kids at school thanks to a donation of three ballistic shields. News on 6's Ryan Gillen tells about how that donation is helping these officers be better prepared for a life-threatening situation. Kevin Lynch has lived in Bartlesville his entire life and is now a realtor. So when he had the chance to provide ballistic shields to the school's officers, he knew he had to do it. We can't prevent the tragedy, but we are able with these shields, I think, are going to go in and be able to stop that tragedy from escalating any further. Kevin donated the money to Stand First Foundation, a local nonprofit that provided the three shields. Scott Walton founded Stand First and says the goal is to make sure police officers have this life-saving equipment, especially for departments who can't afford it. Unfortunately, uh, you know, these things are something you never want to have to use. But uh, unfortunately, we see a need for him daily. After the tragic events in Uvalde, Kevin says he wanted to do something to make sure officers in his community have what they need if they ever face an active shooter. Let's put a shield in front of every officer. That's the goal here. That's why I got involved was the shields and protect our children and teachers and community. And I think every school officer should have one. The shields cost almost $2,000. And Lynch hopes other people in the community will be inspired to donate. We can do everything what thing we can to try to change it. But the fact is, is we need to be able to take care of the issue when the issue comes up. Walton says anyone who would like to make a donation should reach out to Stand First. In Bartlesville, Ryan Gillen, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.